What? You want me? Oh, no, 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 no. I want my books. Hello, welcome back to another Jeepers Keepers. Now that we are done with the A, for now, okay? The first pass, I'm done with the A so far. We will revisit once we get to the X. But let's start with Batman. Now, for this video, it's gonna be just Silver Age Batman. Bronze Age will be another video. You can already guess what's gonna be in the Bronze Age, right? But for Silver Age, luckily I don't have that many. In fact, I only had to weed out one book. Literally one book. And I will tell you why. You know, when it comes down to Batman, Silver Age, it's one era of the Silver Age that I didn't really care to collect. Even other title, not just Batman, okay? I'm, I don't want to single out Batman. I'm just not a big collector of Silver Age DC. I probably, probably had more Silver Age war books. Yeah, DC war books, the 12 centers. I think I have more of those books than Batman, Superman, action, or detective combined. Okay, of course, I'm shooting this video uh, before I s sold my collection of DC War Books because I am in the process. So by the time you watch this video, this might be no longer true as far as me having more DC War Books, Silver Age, than Batman and Superman and Detective altogether. Um, I bought this. Low grade, 4.0. And you know, when it comes down to DC Silver Age, I was, by this point, okay, I can tell you, I add many of these books um, within the last 10 years. I don't have the exact date that I, unless I go and check out the, the, the invoices, but for sure, I bought all of these books within the last 10 years, some even last year. So my desire for high grade or even mid grade was gone already. So I was content with low grade. This was the first one actually. Yeah, this was the very first Silver Edge Batman keys that I bought, I think 10 years ago. I'm pretty sure it's about 10 years ago. I remember buying it just before I moved into this house and we have no, yeah, we have lived in this house for nine years, so yeah. And then this one I bought last year. Okay, issue 136, cool Joker covers. Not the best, but I like it. Only reason why I bought it. And this one, I put it as a 3.0. Yeah, like I said, nothing fancy. Here's Batman 155. Uh, Another low grade book. I think it's about a 4.0 with the penguin on the cover. That's the only reason why I bought it. Now this one is one where I had multiple copies. I had two. I bought one last year and then later last year I found a gorgeous 9.2 ish copy on eBay. So yeah, I'm keeping this one baby. The other one is about I would say maybe 8.0. Pretty nice too for a, a dark deep purple, but this one is gorgeous. I have shown this in uh, a haul video late last year. So yeah, so this was the one where I had another copy that I will eventually sell. But my favorite of the bunch. Love this pink cover. Pink, magenta, I don't know, but yeah, 171. By far my favorite. I mean, I love the purple one too, but my God, that magenta. This one's pretty decent myself, you know, 181, not a bad. Now this copy actually is one where I bought the most. This is my keeper, beautiful. Did I see, what is it, 7.5, okay. I have had, I bought two other copies. Over the years, I have owned three, I think, 
and I had slapped them, the other two copies, and I think I sold them. I gotta check in the closet to see if I, I know I sold at least one, but here's my keeper. It's the only raw one left. Last but not least is my copy of 189. I think it's about um, maybe 5.0. I also own a lot of this book. This is this was a book that I probably had maybe five or so copies over the many years. I'm down to two. I got this one copy here and one slab left to sell, but this is my keeper. So that's it for my uh, Silver Age. Not that many, okay? So how many books is this? Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Only seven Silver Age Batman is making it to the keeper's box. Thanks for watching. Bye-bye.